I've been bad. I have been so bad. I did it again. You guys know that I am a Tory Burch fanatic. I love Tory Burch. It's my favorite brand and I'm loving it more and more all the time. I really do think that the quality is up there with the luxury brands. I really do. Now you might disagree with me, but that's my personal opinion. And the more Tory Burch that I buy, the more that I'm convinced that it is just, the quality is just top notch. So you guys remember when I unboxed these just last week or a couple weeks ago, well, I did go back because this Tory Burch sale has really gotten the best of me. So I'm so happy that I did go back and purchase the other pair or the other color. I'm dropping things. So I wore these tonight and they were so comfortable and I'm just thrilled that I picked up this color, you guys, because they are beautiful. So like I said, I wore them tonight and this is what we've got left of the packaging. And remember I told you guys, um, if you love Tory Burch to shop online or at the boutique because they will send you a $50 gift certificate. So they sent me a $50 certificate to go toward any purchase and I had said I'm going to stop but there's another pair of shoes that I really really want and they're pumps and I think this $50 is going to go toward those shoes so I'm not finished yet but let me show you the ones that I picked up of course you get your your receipt your dust bag and, like I said, I wore these tonight, but this color is absolutely fabulous. It will go with just anything. So, what I have on tonight is just a black tunic with kind of gold velvet sleeves and some black leggings. And I wore these boots and I love them. They're so pretty. I'm just thrilled that I was able to pick these up in my size. And um, on the side, they're just slip-on booties. And then here you have the Tory Burch logo. But is this color not fabulous? So happy that I picked them up. So which ones are your favorite? Do you like the caramel color ones or the black ones? And like I said, if you like these, check out the Tory Burch website. They probably do have some left although the sizes are probably limited but you can always pick them up other places but if you want your um, purchases to go toward a $50 card I would suggest sticking with the boutique or the website but I'm really happy with these and I got yet another pair of Tory Burch loafers all right the other day when I unboxed these gorgeous loafers. I told you guys I would love to have the ones with the velvet. And my size was sold out on the Tory Burch website. So I started looking for them and I found them at Nordstrom. So here they are. Of course, this won't go toward my Tory Burch purchase for another $50 card. But that's okay because I really wanted these. And they also had these same shoes that came with a heel, which is really the ones that I wanted, but I'm thrilled to have these as well. So here's the beautiful box. And here are the shoes, you guys. Oh my goodness. Are these not gorgeous? These are the velvet loafers. I am in love. When I opened up the box, I was like, oh my goodness. So they have these beautiful horse heads, this leather, this snakeskin look, and again, the gold on the heel. They're just fabulous, fabulous shoes. And like I said, they had them with the higher heels, and that was really the ones that I wanted. 
but I'm not complaining because I'm really happy that I got these. And um, I got them at a, a huge discount. I can't remember exactly what I paid for them, but they were quite a bit cheaper. Let's see if it says on here. Um, they're the Jessa Loafer, the Blush Black Cherry, and I don't, I don't see the price, but they were a hundred and something. I can't remember exactly, um, but I know that I got them at a huge discount, and when I saw them, I thought, wow, these are showstoppers, and let me tell you something. So I got these from Tory Burch, and I got these from Nordstrom. So these are a seven and a half, and these are an eight. And I can't tell a lot of difference. When I first pulled these out of the box, I thought they looked narrow, and my feet are kind of wide, but it's they're so soft that I think that, you know, they will stretch, but I wore them around the house, and they were really comfortable. Now, I haven't worn these out, but like I said, these are an eight, these are a seven and a half, and I can't tell a huge difference. These do, of course, feel some looser, but I would say that these shoes are true to size. Oh, I almost forgot my bag of the week. Actually, I've been carrying this bag for a week and a half, and I was supposed to have changed it out Sunday, but we were traveling, so I'll probably just carry this bag the rest of the week, which will be two weeks and I'm loving it. It was on sale on the Tory Burch website, but I don't think it's available anymore, but I did notice the tote just like it. So if you're interested in the tote, I believe it is still on the website. All right, let's move along to this giant bag. So when I was in Panama City and we went to Destin, it's about another beach town over, maybe a 40 minute drive to the outlets. And I really didn't do a lot of damage. I really did not because um, most of this is Christmas. Now, um, I've got, whew, I need a place to sit on this. Okay, so I know my daughter is gonna be watching this, which she's already seen it because I was texting her and showing her pictures of things when I was shopping, and this is the one that she chose. So I got her this classic looking coach backpack, and I think it's absolutely stunning. Let me put this bag down here so I can hold it up for you. It's got just the classic coach logo, and it's leather and this part is kind of a chocolate brown, the leather part, and it has this very usable pocket, unlike my, uh, <laughs> my Palm Spring backpack. Price on this was no, uh, regularly, I don't know if that's gonna pick up, $378, and of course it was at the outlet, and I got this for, I think it was $118. If you're ever in Destin, the Destin Commons outlets are fabulous. And they have Tory Burch, they have Coach, they have Kate Spade, uh, just about anything you're looking for. So this is one of my daughter's Christmas presents. So I got that checked off the list. I had to get something for me. <laughs> I picked up just this black leather Coach backpack. I love it. It's got the little handle here, which, which I love. You know, you can just grab and go. It's got the gold coach, and I love the shape of it. It's a very strong magnetic closure with the drawstring. It has a big pocket in the back, and I just really love the shape of this one. And, um, and then it just has like some gold chains here in the bag, and then just these regular straps. And I tried it on, I walked around the store with it for a while, I put it back, because really, when I went to the outlets, I was really thinking that I was going to get a Tory Burch backpack, and I was wanting a black backpack, because I don't have one, and I 
love carrying backpacks. Thanks to Lisa, Lily LV. She got me hooked on backpacks. And this one, the price was normally $378. And again, I think I think it was about $118 for this. And I mean it's exceptional. It's leather, it's soft, it's fairly lightweight, it's stylish, and I just really wanted to add just a solid black backpack. So this is what I picked up for me. The next thing that I got were these gorgeous coach house shoes. And I am just obsessed with house shoes. And I've been wearing some UGG house shoes that I have had. I have literally had them about seven years and they're still going strong. So I always buy really nice quality house shoes and these are beautiful and so soft. I tried them on in the store and I could not believe how, they, I mean, they're so soft and this beautiful rosy pink color. And my mom had been looking at some house shoes and she was going to get some, I think we were at TJ Maxx and I don't know, something happened, but she didn't get them. So I picked these up for my mom for Christmas. And now these were regular, $100. And they were still kind of pricey, $40. But I think they're worth it, they're gonna hold up. I picked myself up a black pair, and then I chose another black pair that I'm going to give as a gift to someone else. So I actually got three pair of these and you guys just would not believe how soft they are on the inside and I'm wearing my black ones now and just love them. And if you invest in some really nice house shoes, they will really last a long time. Like I said, I have some Uggs and I've been wearing them for about seven years and I even threw them in the wash machine and they're, I mean, they're still, you know, they still look really good. So yeah, here's two Christmas gifts marked off my list. And I think my mom will really like them and I picked these up for someone else in my family. Okay, and then there's just two small items that I picked up and they are just these little wristlets. This one is uh, black, it says Coach, and this one's red. I haven't really decided who to give these to. We do this really fun thing um, at Christmas. Um, I have a party and my family come and in-laws and there's just a big house full of us and Keith and I love to give out prizes. So when everyone walks in the house, they draw a number. So I have uh, giveaways. So I'm probably going to um, gift this one. I have this one in mind to give someone and I'm thinking about including this in the giveaway. And it's funny because we do multiple giveaways and then I do third place, second place, and the grand prize. So I haven't purchased those items yet, but I think this one is going to be included in the giveaway. <laughs> I love to dress up for the holidays, and my husband and I normally go out for a special dinner. So I picked up something from Express because you guys, they're having 50% off. And well, I've picked up several things, but I just wanted to show this to you. It is a jumpsuit, and I know you can't really tell by my holy holding it up, but it's it has a draped neckline, which I thought was really pretty, kind of silky looking with the little straps, and then the pants are just kind of like palazzo, and I'm sure they're too long for me, <laughs> so I'll probably have to have them hemmed. So um, I really should order petites. Um, when I can. I don't know if it came like that, but I thought this was really pretty. You guys know I, I really like um, monochromatic looks and I like plainer things, but I really love the top of it. I love that draped look and I think this will be really pretty for the holidays with some really spectacular earrings. And speaking of earrings, you guys know I'm just an earring fanatic and today I have on my Tory Burch earrings in the gold and I can't find these anywhere. Um, I wanted to pick up a couple pair for some people in my family. I've looked everywhere and can't find them. Um, 
if you do find them, pick them up because they are MIA right now. I just can't find another pair. And so anyway, I came across this pair of earrings. These are by Miranda Fry, and I have purchased some of her jewelry in the past. I have some necklaces, and I have a pair of earrings, but these, I really like these, and I've already tried them on, but they are large gold hoops with the Miranda Fry logo. Well, let's see. Hold it up here. And they're very substantial. They feel weighty, or not heavy for the ear, but they feel, you know, they feel expensive is what I'm trying to say. But um, they're a really good size, a little bigger than my Tory Burch, and you guys know I love hoops. So this is something a little different. And I also picked up a silver pair, but um, they were for my daughter for Christmas, and guess what, I gave them to her. <laughs> And when I was at the beach, I went to Ulta and I did some makeup shopping and I gave her all that today. My phone's going off. Um, but I gave her all that stuff today and her earrings, but she will have a few surprises. <laughs> but if you guys um, are looking for some hoops that are different and comfortable on the ear, let me try them on for you. And I have to say this, Lynette, <laughs> I thought of you. Girl, you know I'm always looking out for you. I think these would be fabulous on you. And I did get them on sale. And you guys, I don't know how much I paid for any of this stuff. I really don't. It, I looked on the packing list and it wasn't there. But aren't these pretty? And she has a really pretty belt with the same logo. And I thought about picking that up at some point but Lynette you know I have to pick on you I really I, I really think you need these because they're so comfortable and um, if you don't want the gold you can get them in silver but I'm really happy with this purchase so these are by Miranda Fry and I found a brand that is new to me and I wanted to share it with you guys. And wow, I'm so excited because um, I've been looking at the website and their jewelry is just different. You know, it's something different. And some of you may have heard of this brand before, Ana Luisa. So this is my very first um, piece from this brand. And they are just these fabulous, I actually wore these earrings tonight. Look at these, just these fabulous earrings, just with this unusual, you know, shape to them. And I just thought this was something different as well. So in the, I am so impressed by the backs of them. They are so substantial, yet lightweight, but so well made and I think I paid about $75 for these. They're not terribly expensive, but they look expensive and they feel expensive. And um, so I wore these tonight actually to the party. So look how pretty these are. They're just different. I'm really loving these and they just feel really nice on and comfortable. Lynette, you need these too. <laughs> So that's my very first piece uh, of jewelry from Anna Luisa. Lynette, girl, you know I love you. I'm always looking out for you. Whenever I get something, I think Lynette needs this. And we've talked about this before, that if we lived anywhere close to each other, we would just be probably living in a van somewhere down by the river together because we kind of had a, have a bad influence on each other. <laughs> That's all I have for you guys today, but I just wanted to show you some of the things that I picked up. The Tory Burch sale is going on, but I'm noticing they are getting really limited on a lot of their things. But I may pick up those other pair of shoes, one more pair of shoes, and then I'm finished. I promise. I probably shouldn't say that, really. I really should not say that. <laughs> 
I have been doing some Christmas shopping though, you guys, but I still have a ways to go. And um, yeah, so that's all I've got for you guys today. I look forward to seeing you guys again next week and I will talk to you soon. You guys have a great week ahead. Bye-bye.